Good morning. It's turned out, well, um, as it turned out nice again, motherfucker. It's the sun's coming out, uh, as you can probably tell by my radiant glowing face. Um, but it was uh, very stormy during the night, exceptionally stormy. It was like a thunder and lightning. It was like one of them lightning, electric storms. That's what they call it, innit? Yeah. Electric storms. I usually have one of them every two months when my bill drops through on my phone. I can fucking go mental. 300 euros. You know what I mean? Is that my t shirt? Yesterday I wore a Donald Trump t-shirt because I like to like tease and have a laugh and a giggle. Do you know what someone said in the comments? Do you know what I said? Should I tell you? You've lost, what was it? All credibility. Well, first of all, I didn't know I had any credibility. Secondly, I don't give a fuck if I've got credibility or not. Thirdly, I don't give a fuck what you think. Fourthly, I don't give a fuck that you've now unsubscribed from my videos. Can you believe how petty some people are? Can you believe that? I used to really enjoy your videos, but now I don't enjoy my videos now. Because I had a Trump t-shirt on for a giggle. I didn't come on here and go, if you don't vote Trump, you're a fucking idiot. I don't care what happens, do you know what I mean? Like, it's just a giggle. Can you imagine people, imagine having like a favourite movie actor or actress. And then maybe that actor or actress comes out and says, you know, well not even says, but has a badge on that says, you know, Kamala Harris or something. Can you imagine going, I used to like all her films, but I don't like them, I've never watched another one again. There's some right soy boys out there, isn't there? Seriously, seriously, they're the people that are fucking society up, you know that, don't you? Because they're the people that will not allow you or I to have a different opinion. There's lots of people watching my videos have tons of different opinions, right? It doesn't matter, does it? Does it matter? If you, if you, for example, can't stand Donald Trump, am I going to say, I don't want you watching my videos anymore? I used to like your comments. <laughs> the fuck is wrong with these people? They're the ones that are making the world all mental. Because what? Listen, imagine saying that I'm unsubscribing. I'm unsubscribing. You've hurt me feelings. <laughs> that wasn't the only numpty yesterday either. No. I, it, for balance, I did have more people yesterday say I love the t-shirt. No, it's just a giggle, isn't it? I like me American politics. I'm going out there next weekend for the US election. I'm going to America specifically to be in the country for the US election. I like my politics, you know what I mean? But I'm not going to like, oh, I'm not going to cry about stuff. What's that all about? Do you know what I mean? Listen, you're one of the things I'm most passionate about. Fuck off. Sorry, I just know a few people then said something about food. No. Like I'm most passionate about fox hunting when it comes to political reasons in the UK for voting. I don't like fox hunting, right? Very passionate about stuff like that, right? I don't like animals being tortured and shit. And um, unless it's going on my plate. And um, my mate Ben, he's like my bestest mate out there in England, you know what I mean, back home. And, you know, they, he has a farm, he's in country, he lets the hunt go through his land as far as I'm aware. But I wouldn't sit there with him, in, you know, in a pub and go... <coughs> I used to like you when we were at school together, I don't like you anymore. He's just like, it's his life, my life, we have different opinions. <sighs> Let me make it perfectly clear, right? I make my videos around here for the people that like my videos. We're not trying to impress anyone, right? And we certainly don't give a fuck about your feelings. All right, grow up. Right, so the next numpty, right? I had a couple come in the, uh, the stream yesterday. I don't know if it was one person and they changed the username because they forgot what account they were logged in on. But they said I need to apologise to Miguel Delaney. Do you know that journalist? He said in the Independent, I think, on Tuesday, he sort of waff was waffling on about Newcastle and then put a little bit in that maybe the Saudi Arabians might want a bigger club. Might, may, you know, and, and mentioned Liverpool amongst other clubs, Chelsea and maybe, maybe he made Barcelona or something, I can't remember. Uh, and I said I thought it was a little shite. He said, you need to apologise. He, he knows more than you do. How do you know he knows more than I do? How do you know that? Well, because I'm sitting in the kitchen and I'm not working for something called The Independent. He's the one working. I'm not. I'm on the Mediterranean. I'm all right. You know what I'm saying? You know? I, yeah, I, I'm here for shits and giggles. You know what I mean? I mean, I want to earn a few bucks. I've got to pay the bills and that. Like, people like what I do. So if people want me to make videos and give up my time, then I'll say, I'll do that for you. Meet me halfway, buy me a coffee every now and then. Jobs are good, you know what I mean? I have to apologise to a journalist because I disagreed with him. Another fucking sorry boy. Seriously, guys, they're all a bit wet, aren't they? Can't say what I really want to say, but it involves a coshing. Right, <clears throat> now, 
Did I tell you it was really bad weather last night? I think I did, didn't I? Yeah, I did. Electric storm. It was very bad. And little man here, my friend, who's already been fed, by the way. Um, hello, are you all right? Do you want to see him? Do you want to see Remy? Let's see if we can see him. Where is he? Hello? All right? Hello? Hello? Well, it was about four o'clock in the morning. And it was, I mean, it was absolutely... I've got a video. Because <laughs> my girlfriend's coming out today. As you know, right, she's flying out today uh, from Inglaterra, right? And she's really looking forward to coming out to Spain for, like, the nice weather. <laughs> uh, there you go. Oh, oh. It was like that last night, right? That's about four in the morning. And I thought of Remy outside. I mean, he's got his bed and he's, it's sealed. It's, it's, Remy's got a better fucking house than I have. He has. Someone asked in the comments, I didn't get a chance to reply. Um, yeah, it's gated off. Like, if I go out for the day, he has the full run outside everywhere. On guard. You know what I mean? Uh, but when I want to section it off, if I want to go outside and have some peace and quiet, there's like a nice little... Well, there's a really high, like, fence and gate there he's got his own little area he's got his own waterproof can but i was like i'm not leaving him out there i thought he might be scared in thunder because dogs don't like thunder do they? you know what i mean so i came trundling down at four everything was swinging left right and center and i came down and got him and brought him in and i let him sleep in my bedroom i took his bed and put it next to my bed all night long <laughs> benny shut the fuck up all right so i'm a bit tired this morning so right that's the numpties out of the way the dog out of the way what we're doing, we need to do some acknowledgements, don't we? Oh, I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're going to go and get the Sunday papers soon. I'm not having a cup of tea or a coffee now to brush my teeth. But I'm going to go. It's, it's five past nine already. I've got loads to do. She don't get here till tonight, but fuck me. Do you know what I mean? Like I'm tidying up and... Oh, it's a nightmare. <clears throat> Making sure there's things that shouldn't be here, you know what I'm saying? I'm only joking, darling. <clears throat> she don't watch my videos. She genuinely doesn't watch my videos. She's the only one that doesn't. My actual girlfriend doesn't watch my videos. My ex-girlfriend does. Um, <clears throat> uh, what was I going to say? Uh, cleaning, cleaning, papers. Yeah, I'm going to go and get the uh, Spanish football dailies today. Um, honestly, I had, I had that many loons yesterday. Is it because it's Halloween? I was like, do you know what? I'm going to have a peaceful life for a few weeks. And I thought... I'm just going to do the Spanish dailies, you know, for channel members and uh, my briefings. I'll revert back to channel members. Everything's going to be for channel members for a bit. Because I just felt like I needed a break from all the fucking lunatics, you know what I mean? But then good people miss out, and I don't like that. Um, <clears throat> shout out, let's give some shout So I'll go and get the Spanish papers. Now, in terms of streams, um, there will be no Saturday night steaming. Streaming, streaming, sorry, tonight. Well, actually, I tell a lie. There won't be Saturday night steaming, but there might be Saturday night streaming. I might do a stream this evening for an hour or so if you're around. No no shenanigans or anything like that. Uh, this afternoon, there could be a stream. Um, it depends. I've got a few things to do. Um, and I'm going to the football today to see David Villas Benidorm in action. They're at home. Uh, and they're right at the foot of the table, having got promoted last year. Uh, but I'm going. It's a home game. There's a bus going because it's at another stadium because ours is the pitch isn't in good condition. So I'm going to go on that this afternoon. And it's going to be difficult not having a drink. I'd like to have a drink with the boys. You know what I mean? But got to do the airport run tonight. She did say last night again. Why don't you just like you know get me a taxi? You know. Well, she didn't say get me a taxi. She said I'll get a taxi. But I'm a gentleman. I could never do that. What are you like? If you're a fella, are you like that? Would you go, no, you'd pay your own fucking cab. I bet you would, wouldn't you? Do you know what I mean? If you go on a date with a girl, do you not look after her? Do you know what I mean? Like, even if even if you go on a date with a girl, think, can't stand her. I don't mean, like, like appearance-wise, well, maybe that. But, I mean, if you went, like, no, I don't like her attitude, she's a fucking, you know what I mean? I'd still pay for a cab. I'll make sure she gets home safely. I'd still pay for all the group. Are you like that? Is there any real men left in this world? Do you know what I mean? But you've got to be careful you don't get mugged off, though. You've got to be careful you don't get mugged off, because there's some serial dates. Fortunately, I'm not caught up in that anymore. Thank fuck. <coughs> right, 
Can you hear what old dogs have worked? Remy, your mates are up. <whistles> Can you hear them? What happens is someone walks past with a dog with a bitch and they all go, oh, I'll give that. Do you know what I mean? That's what that is. Yesterday's streams. I'd like to thank the following people for buying what are called super chats. John Conway, Daryl Kensington, Jace Redman 75, Hickman, Mother Cop Talk, Jen, Copites of Anfield, Gareth Turner, William Kecho, Brother Ben, Neil and William. Rick Roche, Lee Patterson, Watsy, my man. Uh, and John Carland as well. They are uh, people that supported the streams yesterday. Thank you, guys. Uh, it's a big help. Um, I think yesterday... Um, no, that was before then. Let's have a look. Any screenshots? Have I took any screenshots? Sometimes I have to take screenshots to, to remind myself of things. Oh, I'm going to read that in a minute. Stay tuned, especially if you're Jen. Right, uh, what else have we got? Right, okay, so we go to YouTube now. I can't find my documentation that's given me approval to enter the US. Uh, and I've got a week to go to find it. <laughs> uh, here we go. Uh, super thanks. So these are the thanks. There's a button under the videos that says thanks. We're going to super shut that window because the sun is getting in my eyes a little bit. <clears throat> Rob Simpson bought me a coffee yesterday. Thank you very much, Rob, you fucking hero. Uh, the, what's that? Thelma Ma Viaduct. Thel, Thelma Viaduct. Thelma, I've got it there in the end. I think that always happens without using it. Uh, <clears throat> absolute, this is what I mean. The difference in people. And he's, he, he took to Fiverr in the kit and he says, for an expensive coffee. I think I said yesterday, oh, I don't go for expensive coffees. I just go to my local cafe. Do you know what I mean? Like 162 quid, something like that. <clears throat> I don't even think it's that. And, uh, and you get free biscuit. I don't go to Starbucks or up like that. Do you know what I mean? He said, I think that's what that is. He says, for an expensive coffee and a wink. And I put, ha, thanks, brother. And he put, <clears throat> you're welcome, dude. Good we can disagree and still be pals, thumbs up. Now, I don't know what we've disagreed on, right? We we'll probably would, I think that might have been something to do with um, potential, you know, people that might have money in the Middle East, whether they should, what they can pay, shouldn't pay, going to them, but just to do with uh, the Middle East sort of thing. I think it was that, <clears throat> but it's irrelevant. And um, good, we can disagree and still be pals. Do you see the difference in the maturity there? You know, how someone's being brought up and like, you're allowed to have different opinions to people. Do you know what I mean? You're allowed to have different opinions to people. And I guess we disagree on something in the comment section, but we've not spat our dummies out. Do you know what I mean, guys? That's the sort of people I want round here. Not sorry boys and all that. You know what I mean? Sorry girls as well. Don't want them wimp motherfuckers. Do you know what I mean? I really don't. It gets my back up so much. It really does. I can tell, you know, I find it more annoying and... and Makes me more angry than abuse. Abuse doesn't, uh, doesn't really bother me because that's just like you have that all your life, don't you? Well, I do. If you've got, if you've been online for many years, you know you get a lot of hate and shit, um, and that comes with the territory, right? As I'm sure Miguel Delaney, the Independent, gets as well. Being a journalist, people might disagree with him. Um, abuse is one thing, but when people are just like. Like, I really don't give a fuck if someone unsubscribes to my channel. Why would I, why, what, I never, ever, ever say, hey, if you're new around here, please subscribe to my channel. The only time I ever mention subscribing is to the people on X when we do a live stream. And I'll say, look, if you want to you know, follow the, the, the chat on the next stream, you must come across to the YouTube channel because you can't see it on X, right? I don't care. I'm not here to grow a YouTube channel. I'm not. I wish every month was like August, you know, because it's like lots to talk about. You know what I mean? Lots of interest, lots of things. The revenue in, in August was phenomenal. You know, it would make my life a lot easier. I wouldn't need to uh, you know, have channel memberships and that to, you know, to contribute towards things. Uh, you know what I mean? But um, no, I really don't give a fuck if someone stays here or not. I'd rather they did stay if they're nice people. And that's all it's about, isn't it? Like, Thelma Viaduct, just be a nice person. Hey, you know what? We've got a difference of opinion. You know, and when it comes to, like, politics, as well, well, I don't like Donald Trump, but I think he's funny. Oh, does it matter? No, it doesn't, does it? We're talking about Liverpool, aren't we? 
I used to like your videos. Used to, I used to, used to like all my, oh, you liked all my videos, but I wore a t-shirt and now we don't like them. <laughs> what a wanker. I'm, I need to reply to this, man. Uh, uh, what can I put? I need to put this in real time. Um, always pals. And then we put like, uh, we're going to do, uh, we're going to do a, a William salute. Always pals. There you go. See the difference in people. Oh, give me people like that any day of the week than some fucking numpty. Right. Um, <clears throat> Carl Russell trying to bait me into Friday frolics last night. They <laughs> put that towards Friday frolics. No. Uh, I think that's it. I think that's it, guys. I, Gareth Turner um, <clears throat> sent something yesterday on Monzo, I think. It's the links in the video description. Which is instant. It's which is funny because when I go and do the the, uh, the newspapers in the morning, I sit in the cafe. And I'll be sat in the cafe, and then it'll flash up from Gareth. You go get another coffee it, because it's instant. YouTube, you have to wait the twenty third of the following month. Um, <clears throat> it's, it's funny. Thank you, Gareth. It's Cop out to Vanfield YouTube channel. He's doing really well now. He's broke seven hundred subscribers in three months. Wow! But he's putting a lot of effort in and. Um, if anyone deserves it, he does. Uh, is that it? Oh, I wanted to read this out to you. From Russell Parlin. All right, lovely chap. All right. Getting that sun in my eyes. <clears throat> Don't let the sun go down on me. Hi, Dunk. This is off topic. But I just got a notification that I've been gifted a membership for a month. Now, um, this was Jen that did this, and other people do this as well. Um, you can attend a live stream. I don't know if you can do it on a video. You'd have to look if there's a gift. I don't think there is. I'm not sure. Uh, but on a live stream, you can gift a membership. And YouTube picks someone at random, the person gifting the membership, and the host, myself. We have no say in it. It's just like, oh, you, you give the membership uh, and YouTube goes, hey, Russell's been really loyal. He's been, uh, you know, um, interacting, watching or whatever. So the more, if you if you haven't got a membership, the more you thumbs up a video, uh, the more you comment, interact with the channel, the more they watch your videos, YouTube de deems you loyal. All right, if you just come along and watch and, and don't comment, don't thumbs up, it's fine. But YouTube says, no, you're not deserving. You know, if you don't believe me, Google it. Because I was like, how does it work? You know, like, gifting, how does, you know... Anyway, <clears throat> he was gifted a membership. I just want to say to the person, that was Jen, who gifted me the membership, thank you. I'm not in a position to do memberships at the minute as I'm a full-time carer for my son and have some health issues myself. This membership not only lets me see your members-only videos, but also my son as well. Your videos and morning briefings are a godsend. Hello, Remy. Oh. And it helps to have you appear throughout the day and talk to us as a normal person. I know I've said it before, but you genuinely care and look out for your community, and I feel honoured to be part of the inner community for the next month. Why NWA from two happy supporters in the UK? Now look at the difference again in the people that rock up to your channel. Get on with it. Fucking do it. Fuck. Do you know what I mean? And someone like that. These are the people. Uh, that I care about and I do look out for my community and I wish I could do so much more for all you really good people that are here for the right reasons I really do uh, and when I drop my lottery I'm going to I promise you right uh, and I'm gonna drop it and you'll be so grateful that you were on the right side you know what I mean by that like being a nice person <clears throat> and um, first of all with reference to being a full-time carer for my son you're a hero you know, I, I can imagine, well, no, I can't imagine um, how difficult it must be for you. I can probably think I can imagine, but I bet I can't get anywhere near to what it's really like. You know, I have a paralysed cousin uh, and I see what my, my auntie and uncle, you know, not... I see how hard it is for them and how stressful it can be at times, you know when things are maybe going wrong or, but everyone loves each other and it's just, you know, they've, they've been robbed of uh, a normal life, 
Do you know what I mean? Like you're saying there, I'm a normal person. <clears throat> I think I've uh, taken a few life beatings, but what I mean is I think you're a hero and you're not the only one on here as well because there's other individuals on here that are exactly in a similar situation to you. And, I, and I, what I mean by that is I'm, a, I'm acknowledging them as well at the same time. You're all heroes. Uh, and I'm really glad that your son uh, can see this for you. I would really appreciate if you could tell me how old he is. Maybe his name, I could give him a shout out or something. I'll, and I'll, I'll be on my best behaviour in that video. Um, it's nice. Thank you, man. It's nice. But yesterday I had some really <coughs> shitty uh, comments yesterday. Um, more so than usual. It's very rare that I have to ever hide, ban someone from the channel. A YouTube ban is you hide them from the channel. So you never see their comments again. You don't see them. I don't see them. They see them. They think we can see them. They can go in a live chat and then their comment comes up in the middle of everyone's thing, but we don't see it. Never, ever. And it can't be reversed. It should be able to be reversed, but it can't. There's a fault on my channel. So it's like one chance, that's it, gone. That's why it's so important if someone's being sarcastic, you always leave an emoji because I'll just think, is he being fucking... Because I have zero tolerance. Do you know what I mean? And... Um, <clears throat> I want to read another comment out if I can find it. I think it, over the course of a typical month, zero people I have to hide from the channel. It happens maybe every once, every two or three months. In the last few days, four or five people. Now, I don't know why that is. I've got, I'm sure I said the same thing last year and went, is it Halloween? I'm sure last October, around last October, I'm certain, I'm sure I said last year, is it because he's fucking out of me? Do you know what I mean? Don't know why it is. Um, I don't care, just get rid of him. Zero tolerance. Uh, Leia, Leia Hayes, is that? Uh, hey, Dunk, relatively new subscriber, but enjoy your work. Thanks for the content. Hey, thank you. And thanks for um, hanging around. Got the impression you don't take yourself too seriously. And I like your no nonsense approach to all LFC. Yeah. I don't, I like a giggle. I can be very serious when I need to be. Exceptionally serious. Um, I think people think this just dumb, you know, you know, fuck it. I can be very serious. Um, but I try to make my, my channel informal and fun, you know. Uh, and I do absolutely have a no-nonsense approach to Liverpool Football Club. And I think that <clears throat> if you're a gushing fan, you know, you, you don't see, you will never see bad in anything to do with the club. Do you know what I mean? Like, if someone comes in here and goes, you are, you know, <clears throat> Mo Salah scored two last night, but he should have had that third. That's a perfectly fine thing to say. But then you get, I can't believe you just said that about Mo. What sort of a fan are you? Do you know what I mean? Like, we really don't want them people around here. We want people around here that can, you know, have an educated conversation, I guess, you know, and say, yeah, he could have had three. What's wrong with that? You know, we finished second. We fin oh, finishing second is not first, is it? You know, so... We don't want them soy boys and soy girls, you know what I'm saying? <clears throat> and I think the fact that it's probably a bizarre thing to say when you run a YouTube channel to do a Liverpool football club and you run the website and everything, all right? When you're, he you're the head of this community, Liverpool community, it's probably not the best thing in the world to turn around and say, I don't give a fuck, really. But I don't. I genuinely don't. Like, in terms of Liverpool being successful, I want them to be successful for you, not for me, because I'm... I don't know, the top flight game just changed. And maybe because I've done this for so long that you, it turns you off a little bit. You know what I mean? Um, but I think it gives me a different angle on things. <coughs> you know, people that run YouTube channels are always gushing about things and they sat there and, you know, I've got my latest Liverpool top on. There's nothing wrong with that. But you know what I mean? And they've got the pictures on the walls and there's nothing wrong with that. I've done it all. But me, I'm like, no, I'm still standing in my kitchen and you know, Remy's out there chewing a bone. Um, and I think it means that it gives something different and when I'm excited about something to do with Liverpool, people will be like, fuck if Dunk's excited. Do you know what I mean? <clears throat> yeah, I like my approach. Uh, I don't care if no one likes it anyway. Um, but I know you like it, which is good. One question. <clears throat> and forgive me for asking, I forgive you. But are you wearing that T-shirt for a joke? <laughs> That'll be the Donald one. And she's put a laughing face. Uh, yes and no. Like, more so yes. 
to be honest. It is a giggle. I bought that T-shirt as a joke to wind my friend up um, a while ago. I don't know if it was that one or the one before it. <clears throat> it started in the pub one weekend. He was going on about how much he hated Donald Trump. We used to meet every Friday, me and three other lads, three guys. Uh, so the next Friday, I turned up in the Donald Trump top and he went mental. In fact, he took a picture of me and put it on his face because I wanted to strangle me, you know. Uh, he's very politically left. And then he was talking about, well, there's only one person I hate more than him, and that's fucking Boris Johnson. I was like, all right. Who <coughs> would have been PM at the time, I guess. <coughs> Still got that chesty thing. <coughs> and uh, so you know what I did the next weekend? I got a Boris T-shirt. And then it was Tony Blair the following weekend. You know what I mean? Uh, then he mentioned something about Margaret Thatcher, but I thought, I'm leaving that there. Um, so... Um, yeah, it's a giggle, but I do like my US politics. I am going to America uh, next weekend to be there for the US election. Uh, I have friends uh, heavily involved in US politics. Um, I'm more politically uh, right-leaning, um, but I, I just like, you know, I can take a bit from the left and a bit from the right and say, why, you know, why do you have to hate your opposites or something? Like, why can't you turn around and go, well, that's all right, that policy or that's, a, do you know what I mean? Um, <clears throat> I went to a, a Democrat uh, barbecue and party when I was out in Wisconsin, you know, a couple of years ago with like loads of people that wanted to meet me because I was over there working on something to do with all of that stuff. And lovely people, you know, I met people from the BLM, I met people uh, from the opposite side, what was called the Kenosha Guard, the Conservatives, you know, people that want to carry guns openly and stuff like that. And, you know, this is what goes on in America is their business, right? It's their business. I find some of it fascinating. Um, I like um, the theatre of it all. Donald Trump, he triggers people. Do you know what I mean? Um, <clears throat> in answer to your question, yeah, it's a joke. It is a joke to see if I can like make people giggle a little bit. Um, but also at the same time, I'm, it's, yeah, I do like the Don, I've got to be honest. Um, <clears throat> Yeah, but it's not like, you know what I mean? Like, if you said to me, I can't stand him, I go, yeah, I, I completely understand why you might think like that. So it's just a bit of fun for me. Uh, and also, get well soon, uh, Hajinda. Uh, I need to find Hajinda's comment because <clears throat> he left a comment and um, fight, he was fighting for his life and he hadn't been out of the hospital for a long time and he was commenting on the vids, uh, telling me about that and thanking me... Um, so yes, I think it was yesterday's morning briefing and a stack of people left comments for him. So I do appreciate your comment. Uh, I really do. Um, it's friendly. Um, <clears throat> I like the fact that you, you're laughing about the T-shirt rather than crying about it. And um, yeah, please do uh, hang around. Please do, yeah. <clears throat> Sorry, guys, I still do have this, um, this chesty thing. In fact, <clears throat> I just remembered I didn't take my medication yesterday for it. The antibiotics have stopped. Um, but I've just realised I didn't, what do you call it, I'm supposed to take this mixture. <coughs> Reckon I can put it in orange juice, it's got a bit of orange there. I don't suppose it matters really, does it? It's just got to get inside you. I'm supposed to take this stuff, Pectox Lysina. Um, <coughs> which gets things up off your chest without going into details. So, uh, yeah. Oh, guys, <clears throat> I spoke to Harry yesterday, my grandson, uh, and told him, I said, look, I'm sorry that I haven't been able to do anything with your YouTube channel yet. Because <clears throat> he's launching a YouTube channel all about Liverpool. He's only a kid. But his mum's launching it. It can't be in his name. Um... But I explained to him, I said, I, I haven't been very well since I saw you. And, um, <clears throat> you know, I've got Meh United TV to launch. Have you all gone to Meh United TV yet? YouTube.com, M-E-H, United TV. Make sure you go. I've still got the book here, ready. Yeah. <laughs> and I need to do an intro video for that channel. An intro video stays on the channel for years, right? Well, I can't record one where I'm going... <clears throat> every two seconds, so... But that's my priority. That's the next thing I'm going to do. And I will message my partners on that. That's now closed. No one can join that now. But you can subscribe to the YouTube channel. Uh, I don't know. I, I, I'm going to tell that I've got a date in mind where I think I should be able to do it. 
Uh, but I have to do that first, and then we're working on Ari's. All right, Ari's little YouTube channel, bless him. I do apologize. <clears throat> Yeah. <coughs> well, that's that one down. That's that one down the throws. <coughs> Anything else left to tell you? <coughs> oh, yesterday, yesterday's morning briefing. I fucked it up. Um, I had to patch it together, two bits, and I, I did something wrong. I don't know if I uploaded it before it finished encoding. I cut, basically I cut 20 minutes off that video. <clears throat> it just ended abruptly. That was wrong. So I deleted it and I didn't upload it again. I was like, well, I've kind of missed the moment now. So if you're wondering why or where it went, that is why, okay? Um, <clears throat> right. We have a chat room. I'm just reading the chat room. I don't know, we've got a chat room, look, it's all, all, all you guys. Uh, 400 members in there, <clears throat> 400 members. And um, you can join that chat room, it's completely free. You can have it on your mobile phone, you, you, you have it on your laptop. Hey, shout out to Vivek. Um, whatever, you can jump, whatever. Get on the chat room, you like it. You can disable notifications so you don't get pinged all the time. Uh, it's a good place to be when there's a game underway. Transfer deadline day, things like that. Um, the link is in the video description. You don't have to give your mobile phone number. You just have to download an app called Telegram. It's just the same as WhatsApp, really, but better. I use Telegram primarily for my communications with the people I love. Um, <clears throat> and yeah, jump in. You know, you, you can. You don't have to use your real name. You could just put a nickname or whatever. Uh, obviously, we've got a lot of lurkers in there, so I don't say much in there, but. Um, you're more than welcome to join us. <clears throat> That's in the video description, as is the newsletter as well, um, which I keep threatening to send something out on there, but I'm waiting at the moment. Um, and once it's sent out, you'll never get it. Imagine how annoyed you're going to be when I come on here and put a massive, like, juicy thing and go, guys, fucking hell, I can't do a video about it. There's one for the channel members, and I've also done an, an email update about it. If you're not a channel member, you're going to be like, oh, fuck, because it's gone. Do you know what I mean? That should be your backup. The, the news that the link is in the video description. Literally, take you two seconds. <coughs> right. Have we done everything? I feel like I've done loads today. I really need to take that screensaver off. It sends me all over the place every time I open my phone. I'm like, oh, you would. Pretty pink toes. There's a song about that. Yeah. Right. Let's go. I'm going out, son. I'm going to the garage now. Uh, and uh, off to the uh, to, to get the newspapers, go to the cafe. I think what he said yesterday, get yourself a bocadillo, like a baguette. With, with, I shouldn't be having bocadillos, but maybe I could sneak one in this morning. Eh? Got to get that energy up, fellas, you know what I'm saying, don't you? You've got to get some carbs in. <clears throat> She's younger than me. She's younger than me. And not only that, well, no, I've got to be careful because people, I know people that know where to watch my videos as well now. She's younger than me. You should say she's got a lot of energy and encouragement. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm not going to just put my fucking socks on in the morning. Run upstairs and make love to me, she said last time she was here. I said, I can only do one. I don't know, fucking kill me. <clears throat> right, let's get out of here. So, hey, have a great weekend. I'm going to do a live stream today. There will be one. Now, if you want to come to the live stream... <coughs> <clears throat> what you need to do click on my channel name on here whether you're on the app or browser or whatever and there should be a thing at the top that says notifications all right make sure that's set to all notifications and you'll get pinged when i go live the thing is <clears throat> it don't always work so if you've got facebook go to facebook.com forward slash cop talk tv like the page x x.com forward slash app cop talk tv Turn on notifications, follow and turn on notifications. Imperative, I think. I think X is your best one because it's, it will ping you, definitely. The chat room, which you've just been talking about, <coughs> will, you know, you'll know when I'm live. And hopefully we can have a nice little chilled 
little chilled uh, chapter there. In saying that, my kitchen, you know, she's going to be here tonight. She's going to be like, oh, fucking, do you know what I mean? There's a Man United book there. Well, that should go bin, to be honest. It's, it's, I don't even know what these things are. There's all sorts around here. Dog food, shitty tea towel, empty medication wrapper, socks, halls. <laughs> Can you tell I'm lonely today? I'm excited, mate. My chick's coming. I took that picture. You know about that picture, don't you? Yeah. Mm. Did I tell you? I, some of you won't know, but she had a tattoo done this week. My name. She's had my name etched on her body. She's branded now. Belongs to me now. Yeah, real tattoo as well, not fake one. You know what I mean? Not like a temporary one. Real one. I think that means that she intends on hanging around. So that must mean she really likes me, right? She must really like me, yeah? <coughs> Although I know people that have had tattoos before. Uh, trying to convince themselves that they like someone. I hope it's not there. Easy fuck. Easy fuck. She was messaging me at five o'clock this morning going, today's the day, big man. You think it's just call me Big Mags from a bit? Ah, uh, in. Buzzing. So, <coughs> <coughs> let's see why I can't do that channel yet. <coughs> they, um, there will be no watch along tomorrow. No, won't be doing that. It's my first day with my chick, so there'll be no watch along. Streams during the week, I, I highly doubt there'll be any streams in the afternoon during the week. Although she did say to me yesterday, look, you know, you've still got to do things and if you want to do it, I'll, <coughs> um, you know, I can go for a nap or whatever. So we'll see. I think it's best to make sure you've got all the notifications turned on because I might not be able to schedule them. Well, I won't be able to schedule them, I don't think. Might do an evening one, might do Monday, Wednesday, Friday, something like that. <coughs> I will still be here. All right, guys. But I, I, I do need to spend some time with my girl because we live between two different countries. And she's only here Sunday to Thursday. Uh, and then I'm away, you know, so I'm not going to see her again. I'm going even further away. So I do need to see my girl. And <clears throat> I don't know. Happy, don't happy channel. That's what I think. Listen, have a great fucking weekend. That's all that matters. Um, if you're offended by anything I've said in this video, <laughs> good, good luck staying around here for a lot longer. Um, thanks to you amazing people that do take the time to comment, that do watch the videos right through for the proper reason, for the real reason that you want to watch my content. Not because you're a nosy fucker. You know, I don't mind my ex watching because I know she still loves me. I don't mind that. She's not a nosy fucker. Well, she is. <coughs> but there's people, you know, that are on here with like, you know, the little bitches, you know what I mean? But they're still watching, aren't they? Rent free, do you know what I mean? But what I mean is like, if you are one of them people that's here for the right reasons, you thumbs up the video, you leave me a comment. You're nice to other people because you've got to be nice to other people in the comments as well. If you're abusive to other people, I will hide you, ban you from the channel, right? Even if you're someone that I think, oh, they're cool as fuck. You, you disrespect other people, you're gone. <clears throat> We're not having that around here, right? Um, and thanks especially to those of you that do. Buy me a coffee and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? Do you know what, right? <clears throat> I would say we were talking about, I'm not, you're not going to get rid of me today. Then Bocadillo, that baguette, right, is fucking amazing, right? So you get, did you see it yesterday? Do you want to see it? Do you want to see it? I'm going to, show, I'm going to have another one today. It's fucking nice. Oh, God, I've got a message off my, my bank. We will take your monthly repayment on November 3rd. It fucking won't because I'm off. Right. Um, <clears throat> look at this. I know some of you go, oh, it looks disgusting. I don't think it looks disgusting. That's a baguette with sausages, fried onions, melted cheese, and I put my own ketchup on, as you can see. Do you know what? You get one of them, all right? Bocadillo de la semana, Bocadillo of the week, right? And a drink. You can have a beer if you want. Not me, but some people do. Uh, or, a, or a coffee, all right? For six euros. That's not bad, is it? What's six euros? In pounds, I think it's a bargain. That I mean, I don't know what you would pay for that in England or anywhere else. Six euros in pounds, five pounds, bang on, right? And 
you get a, you get a drink, but I think it's supposed to be a normal coffee, but they give me grande, cafe grande, because they have, you know what I mean? They just get, it's dunk, innit? Like, give them a normal coffee, you know what I'm saying? And do you know what I like about going to that, that cafe? When I walked in yesterday, I walked in with my newspapers, as I do. I, I literally sat at the table, and as I sat there, put my papers on the table, that, that my, my coffee was just put right in front of me. They know exactly what I had. I love it. I like that. It's like when you feel special, innit? It's like if you're a pub landlord, you've got to look after people. Even people you don't fucking like. But I think they like me. What do you know what I'm saying? I left all three newspapers yesterday for the owner, so you'd be glad, will not you? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, they look after me. And after that, you're not getting rid of me today. After that, right, there's a lottery shop about three doors down. And I like to play the lottery every day. <clears throat> Only like a euro. It's two lines. It's called Bono Lotto. It's 50 cents a line, right? But you've got to buy two, minimum. And um, I went in and bought some. <laughs> and um, and then I left the shop and I was like, oh, I've got one in my pocket from the other day. So I went back in and there's a little machine on the wall, right? You just put it under like that. And it went bleep prize. I was like, ah, two euros. But it was two euros, so it paid for them. So I went back and he went, do you want two? I went, no, give me four lines. Fuck it. I went all in, guys. Don't know if I've won. I'll let you know this morning. It'll be in your interest, right? If I win, if you're one of the nice people, because I will remember. I, I, do you know what? If I drop that big, well, <clears throat> no, when I drop that big jackpot, because I win the Euro Millions. I know it's like 160 million to one chance or something, but I'm going to do it one day. We were all born, so we we're all winners anyway, right? Miserable Martin will be sat there now going, mm -hmm, fucking wish I weren't born. Um, <clears throat> get well soon, Martin. Uh, fucking hell, we don't want another one fucking dying on us. <clears throat> I know, you better not die on me. I fucking got you. You, your hotel and your train, so it took me hours to do all that. Did my head in doing that train. Where was I? What was I talking about? I can't even remember what I was talking about. Miserable Martin. Born. Jackpot. Oh, yeah. So, when I win the Euro Millions, right, I'm going to go through everyone that's bought me a coffee, every channel member that I can find that's active at the time, because I'm not going to... Because otherwise everyone will join, won't they? You know what I'm saying? Well, I want to go back through years and years and years. Well, no, I won't. I'll get someone else to do it because I'll be rich then. And uh, that, what I want to do is like really like make a big difference for everyone. It's true. It's, my, it's, it's the one thing I can't see would happen. I don't know the extent of what I'd be able to do, but imagine being stinking rich. Do you know what I mean? Like 100 million or something like that. You know, someone going, well, Dunk, I've got like eight grand's worth of debt. And I'll be like, well, there's eight grand, mate, and there's two grand for yourself. I fucking would. I'd tell you now, I swear on my life, that's what I would do. So you better hope it wins, right? We need to win, we need to win the lottery. If I win the Bono lotto, that's not gonna happen because it's like 250 grand, you know what I'm saying? And if I win the, the uh, charity lottery, it's only 35 grand, so you'll be, you're on your own. <clears throat> Might buy you a drink. But I'm gonna do that, I'm gonna win that. I fucking love to do Could you imagine the satisfaction you would get, right, from doing that? like repaying that to everyone that's been super fucking nice to you over the years. And then all them people that burnt bridges and all them people that were nasty and left nasty comments, watching them, well, you won't get to watch them, but knowing that they were sat there thinking, if I'd have been a nice person, I'd be all right now. There's a message in there somewhere. Right, have a great day, guys. Please thumbs up my video, right? That's what all the kids say. Drop me a comment. Let me know what you're doing this weekend. Is there anything in this video you want to comment about? Please let me know. And if you want to buy me a beer. I don't want a beer, to be honest with you. Can't have one today. But I could have one in the next few days. I'm taking her out one day this week. One day next week, I'm taking her out, definitely. We're going to have a full-on sesh. Yeah. Out, I mean in the pub. I don't mean like... Uh, <clears throat> beer, coffee, yeah, definitely. Bocadillo. No, don't buy me a Bocadillo. I, I, I can't have any more Bocadillo. I'm going to have one today, though. But I can't have any more like that. I did get weird, but I get weird every morning. I didn't put any weight on since yesterday, so maybe I can get away with a cheeky Bocadillo. What do you reckon? Or do I have to... See, a Bocadillo... Listen, see, you're not getting rid of me. A Bocadillo, right? Sausage, fried onions, cheese. And a drink, six euros, right? Versus... Versus a cheese and ham omelette. Four eggs think 11 euros with no drink fuck that right, i'm off oh neighbor, neighbor my neighbors are over the window bedroom window right next to me 
She's hot as fuck. I need to look left, but why would I need to look left? Pretend, I'll pretend the dog's down there. Get down, Remy. Get down, get down, get down, get down. Just wanted to see if she was stood there at the window. Sometimes she stands there in a bikini. I think she does it on purpose. Did you hear the window? If you play the video back, you hear it creak. So she must know, right, that you're going to go, oh, what's that noise? You know what I mean? And she stands there with her nipples pushed up against the wind. She doesn't really. It's just what I think. <clears throat> See you later.